Do you think Say played a part in enabling drug cartels and drug trafficking, which is another big kind of um, shadow that hangs over the CIA? At the beginning of the drug war, I would imagine the answer is yes. We CIA has its own counter narcotics division, a division that's dedicated to fighting and preventing narcotics from coming into the United States. So when you when you paint a picture for me, like, do you think the CIA was complicit in in uh, helping drug trafficking or drug use? When I say yes, my exception is I don't think they did that for Americans inside the United States. If the CIA can basically set it up so that two different drug cartels shoot each other by assisting in the transaction of a, of, uh, a sale to a third country and then leaking that that sale happened to a competing cartel, that's just letting cartels do what they do. That's them doing the dirty work for us. So especially at the beginning of the drug war, I think there was tons of space, lots of room for CIA to get involved in the economics of drugs and then let the inevitable happen. And that was way more efficient, way more productive than us trying to send our own troops in to kill a bunch of cartel warlords. So that makes a ton of sense to me. It just seems efficient. It seems very practical. I do not believe that CIA would like, I don't think all the accusations out there about how they would buy drugs and sell drugs and somehow make money on the side from it. That's not how it works. So do you think there's a, on that point, a connection between Barry Seal, uh, the great governor, and then President Bill Clinton, Oliver North, and Vice President, former CIA Director George H.W. Bush, and a little town with a little airport called Mena, Arkansas? So I am out of my element now. This is this is one I haven't heard many details about. Okay. So your your sense is any of the drag, drug trafficking has to do with criminal operations outside the United States and the CIA just leveraging that to achieve its ends, but nothing to do with American citizens and American politicians. Uh, with American citizens, again, speaking organizationally. So that that would be my sense, yes.